Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a memory plan with me for the week of July 12th through the 18th using this B&R paper crafts kit called Under the Sea. So I chose this kit this week because it was shark week. So I thought um, this would be a great time to pull it in. Um, I did use the Rose Colored Days um, it was one of her sub, um, like, s overlay sub box or whatever it's called. Um, I believe this was her last one, but it came with the blue, um, underlays and then the blue headers and then the rest of the stuff is, um, like an iridescent hollow, um, bubble pattern, which was so cute. Um, I loved how this, um, spread turned out. But, um, yeah, so for the base, while I do that, I'll go ahead and answer some more questions, and then once we get to the day-by-day, -day, I'll go ahead and talk about that. So the first question is, you've been given an elephant, you can get rid of it, what would you do with it? What? That doesn't even make sense. What kind of a question is that? I'm going to skip that one. <laughs> What's the funniest thing you've seen on the news? Um, I don't know. But I will say, where I used to live, the news was more like... How can I... It was almost like a morning talk show, so it was very... Like... I don't know how to explain it, but it definitely was more like almost like act like role I don't I don't even know the words to use anyways compared to my local news where I live now it's completely different um that being said I don't watch the news much so <laughs> the next question is if you had to the world's attention for 30 seconds what would you say um absolutely nothing i'll probably scream i mean i'll probably cry and run away <laughs> i don't want anyone's attention um if you could be best friends with a celebrity who would it be mm. that's a hard one just because she's my favorite actress, I'll say Blake Lively. Um, the next question is, if you were to play a song you love right now, what would it be? Um, right now, my favorite song that I've like had on repeat is Maroon 5. It's called Buttons featuring Anuel. He's a like... Spanish Latin hip hop artist, I guess. I don't know. Um, but I love that song. I usually don't like songs that are English and Spanish just because I feel like not a lot of them mix or mesh well. But this one is perfection. I absolutely love it. The next question is Would you rather look like a potato or feel like a potato? feel like a potato <laughs> um what would you do with 10 million dollars i guess this is the same thing as if i won the lottery um the f i don't know if what would i do with the, all of it in, in like the entire amount because that's a lot of money but the first thing i would do is put aside money for all three of my kids and make sure that they're good for damn near the rest of their lives um take care of my mom and then whatever is left I don't know buy some pretty things I don't know shiny I don't, I don't know um how can you tell if someone has a sense of humor if you make me laugh um, if you were to name your 
your hour song, what would you name it? What? I need to look for a different list of questions. <laughs> if you were in a room filled with you and your doppelganger and two million dollars, what would you do? Half and half. <laughs> Um, except like if you're like Elena and um Catherine, then that's a different story, but then again, I, th- I feel like they're both equally deserving just because I feel like Catherine went through a lot to make her the way she was whereas Elena also went through a lot but she chose a completely different path so I I still think half and half and if you don't know who Elena and Catherine is then I'm sorry or Katharina whichever one you prefer the next question is what is in the fridge right now um food what have you learned about life from kids? Um, that's a hard question. Because I have learned a lot from my kids. But I, I don't know how to explain it. It's more of what they've made me see within myself like I I've completely changed like you can see the progression of my change throughout each kid like I am not the same person I was when I before I had my first child after I had my first after I had my second and then after I had my son like it I've completely changed um and I would like to say, in, you know, for the better, but um, I'm still growing. I'm still learning. They teach me something new every day. So, yeah. How would you want to be remembered? I, I, I want people to remember that I did what was best for me and my kids. And if, yeah. Gosh, I didn't want to leave it on such a bum note. But anyways, let's move on to the day by day. So in the sidebar, I used this Pumpkin Paper Co. little shark um, to mark that it was Shark Week. Um, So starting on Monday, the first thing I marked was that... um, we got McDonald's breakfast with a sugar box stickers little hash brown and a McDonald's script from Murdoch Talks. Um, the next thing I marked was that I was anxious with a once more with love. Sorry, I'm looking at what I'm changing. But it it was a once more with love, um, anxiety munchkin, and an anxiety script from, I believe, Kinsey's Creations? No, I used it in my feeling script. As you can see, I don't have my planner in front of me. Or as you can hear. Whatever. So the next thing I marked was that I took a nap with a vanilla um, sleeping from Paper Shire and a nap script from Kinsey's Creations. Then I marked with a munchkin that I cleaned. The clean script is from Letters to Apollo. Um, The next thing I marked was... I'm sorry, I'm trying to wait till filming me catches up because I have no, I honestly have no idea. Okay, I use a Winston um, cooking character sticker from Nightingale Paper Co. and a cook custom script from Sugarbox stickers. Then I marked that I did some homework with an icon from SPC and a homework script 
and hollow from Kinsey's creations. Um, then with a little munchkin looking outside of, at the rain, I marked that we had a lightning storm. It was, it sounded so beautiful and it looked beautiful, but kind of scary. And then I marked that I couldn't sleep that night. Um, moving on to Tuesday, the first thing I marked with this little piggy bank from, I believe, Nicole Alexia Designs. Um, I marked something personal, um, with a little tea cup bow icon from Sadie Stickers. I marked that we went to Duncan. The Duncan script is from Letters to Apollo. Then I marked that we went back to school shopping. Um, the script is from SPC and the crown box is from Fox and Pip. Um, then I marked that we went shoe shopping. Um, the little munchkin is from SPC. Um, the next thing I marked with a house icon was that I tidied up. Um, both are from SPC. Then I marked... What What did I mark? <laughs> oh, um, with an SPC icon, I marked... Um, that I had to call my daughter's doctor. Um, then we had McDonald's. Um, the little McFlurry is from Sugarbox Stickers. And the McDonald's script is from Murdoch Talks. Um, and then I marked that we got our puppies that day. Um, and then with the drumstick from Planet Hannah, I marked that we got Buffalo Wild Wings. I did that out of order, but you, you get it. Um, on Wednesday, with a Once More With Love Munchkin, I marked that I was tired AF. Um, those puppies kept me up. But with a little Panera bag from, I believe, Fruity Sticker Co. I'm sorry, I don't know. I'll leave it down below. Um, I marked that we had Panera with a stethoscope icon from SPC. I marked that um, I took my daughter into a doctor's appointment. The appointment script is also from SPC. Then with a bow car icon from CD stickers, I marked that we had to take the, our car in. Um, with another bow icon, I marked that we went to Target. The Target run script is from Magical Stickers Co. Um, then with a house icon, um, I marked that we got our propane filled, and then with the vanilla um, sleeping on the pillow, I marked that I was sleepy AF, and that's from Letters to Apollo. I'm sorry if I'm going so fast, I'm trying to keep up because I don't have my planner in front of me. <laughs> and then I slow right back down. <laughs> um, but on Thursday, the first thing I marked was that um, I did some homework. So... <laughs> The reason why I had a hard time this week was because I've never used one of um, B&R Paper Crafts kits. So I was still trying to get used to um, the boxes that I had to work with. I, I loved the format of the kit. I just had to get used to it. Um, her paper is super thin. So it it was a little hard to work with, but... Other than that, I, I actually really like the kit and the format and stuff. It just took a little getting used to. But with the SPC um, icon, I marked homework. And the homework script is from Kinsey's Creations. With a Once More With Love um, cloud planner, I marked planning time. And the planning time script is from Kinsey's Creations. Then um, with a emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co., I marked that I had some me time. And that's from Kinsey's Creations as well. And then with another emoji, I marked that me and my daughter had a dentist appointment. Um, the appointment is the appointment script is from SPC. And then I marked that um, we picked up our car from the shop. Um, we, and that, uh, foiled, um, bow icon is from, um, Sadie Sickers. Um, but then I marked that 
we went to Sam's Club. The Sam's Club script is from Kinsey's Creations. And then the um, little car is from SPC. And then I don't remember what the last thing was. I'm sorry. <laughs> but moving on to Friday with a paper and milk little Maru. I marked that I had a lazy day. The lazy day script is from SPC. Um, then I marked that I had a nap with my son. The nap script is from Letters to Apollo. And the mom, the baby, is from Benita's Creations. Then I marked some playtime with a Kinsey's Creation. No, that is a Plana Hannah custom, I believe. Um, I marked playtime with the kids. And that's a Once More with Love little boop munchkins. Then I marked with an emoji from Coffee Monsters Co. that I had some me time with a Kinsey's Creation script. And then I marked with a little taco from Plana Hannah that we got Mexican food. And then the heart icon is from SPC to mark that I had some time with my husband. And the with hubs script is from um, SPC. So moving on to Saturday... And I think this is where I started having the most, like, difficulty with, um, like, trying to figure out what boxes I had left, what I needed to use. Um, I do like the sizes of the smaller boxes because if you can see, the little things are actually a little thicker than the other boxes. But I like that they're different. They're not all the same thing. But anyways... Um, So the first thing I marked on Saturday with a Carly Plans house doodle was that um, my husband mowed the lawn. Um, Then I marked that we played outside. The script is from SPC and the munchkins are from Once More With Love. Then I marked that me and my husband put our grill together. Um, That little toolbox is from Paper Shire. And then with the money icon from SPC, I marked some personal things. Um, And then with the pizza icon from Plana Hannah, I marked that we had pizza for lunch. Um, With the paper shire little bunny family, I marked that we had some family time. And the script is from Plana Hannah. Then I marked that I bought all the stickers that day. The script is from Kinsey's Creations. And I'm sorry, I wasn't sure what icon or character I used for that one. But the last thing I marked on Saturday was um, with a foiled wax icon from, I think it was from a freebie from Fantasy Wax. But I marked that I subscribed to the Villainous Wax sub box that day. Um, But moving on to Sunday, um, we'll see the first thing I marked because I don't remember. Um, So the first thing I marked with the paw bow icon was that um, my pups were being naughty, but they didn't know better. So that was fun. And then I marked that we went to Walmart with a Plana Hannah script and a Mixie Cat stuff Walmart um, doodle. And then with the little teacup bow icon from Sadie Stickers, I marked that we went to Duncan. The Duncan script is from Letters to Apollo. And then I marked with a scribbler. I don't remember. I I don't know what the the specific one is called, um, but I marked that we did some yard work. I didn't have anything else to mark it with, so I just used a little watering plant or gardening one. Um, sorry, I'm a little out of frame for the bot. Oh, there you go. So the next thing I marked was that I spoke to my neighbors that day, Um, and the munchkins are from Once More With Love. Then with the cloud planner, I marked that I had some planning time, 
and the script is from Kinsey's Creations and then the last thing I marked was um, that we made some s'mores and the munchkin is from Once More With Love um, and that is it you guys I hope you guys enjoyed it I love all the foily bits but I'll see you guys next time please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe bye